What is up you guys, Ecube here. In this video, we will be taking a look at Cina Punch, which is one of the largest asset pack on Video High with over almost 10,000 elements. Cina Punch pack compatible with both Premiere Pro and After Effects as well. It is also compatible with other video editing softwares like Final Cut Pro, etc. So I just introducing this pack to you guys because of the major reason. This pack is really amazing and impressive. I really felt very impressive to use this pack because of its high quality content and insane number of elements i really wonder how they created almost 10,000 elements in high quality they included everything like transitions sound effects and all the visual effects elements for every type of editor if you make videos or make vlogs content creator so this pack will help you a lot to save your time and obviously to make your video really amazing if you want to know more about cine punch go ahead and check out the link in the description below so without further any ado let's jump into the video. So when you download Cine Punch, it's something look like this. Everything is arranged very well. As you see, the first folder is Tutorials. That's really impressive. They really care for their beginner clients. And in the Tutorial folder, you got PDF, which contains tutorials for everything separately. As you see, they are providing you bunch of the tutorials for every pack. Like if you just click on the Assess here, and now you got a tutorial for the anamorphic creams. So they are providing you a proper tutorial for the sub packs what we are exploring later the second folder is big pad that's really huge because if i go into the pdf you came to note that this pack contains several different sub packs like sound punch which contains some of the very amazing sound effects so this sub packs really huge as you see 20 gb 1.7 gb 1.2 gb but that's not problem with their size the point is they are in a high super quality and the packs are absolutely amazing to use because they are compatible with working 8k resolution so you can use this pack with any kind of resolution footage you want as this pack contains several different sub packs as you see fractals which is very helpful to adding some of the very amazing motion backgrounds in your projects they provide you more than one server that means downloading path so you never face problem to download this pack you have choice to select the best server for yourself the next sub pack is glitter bokeh matter which is contain many of the light leaks as well as you see they provide 10 of the elements of course they offer 10,000 elements so that's pretty difficult to cover every pack separately in a particular video so let's go ahead to other folders now Cinepunch also provides leak color overlays in a resolution of 4k that's really good to use in a video it's super easy to use just drag and drop it on your footage and just change normal to screen and I'll set a beautiful light leak added in your footage The next folder offer many of the LUTs for your body footage to make it more realistic. It is in format of preset for both Premiere Pro and After Effects. In a plus point, they provide you preset for every version of Premiere Pro like 2013 to 15, 17 to 18 and 2019. And even if you have 2020 version of Premiere Pro, you may also choose according to your version of Premiere Pro. And now here you got your preset file LUT master. Let's see how it is work all you have to do just go to your premiere pro now go to your effects panel if the effects panel is not appears there don't worry about it just go to windows now select effects and it will automatically add it in your premiere pro and now go to your preset now right click import preset now select your preset location i just selected my preset location and after a few seconds it will automatically add it in your preset folder and now we just extracted and as you see they are providing you many of the folders for the LUTs. if we extract it you just go inside of it and as you can see they are providing you different kind of the cinematic LUTs that really help you a lot in your videos to make it more realistic now the more realistic method to use this list is used adjustment layer and drag and drop it any LUT what you would think that's perfect for your footage how we can do that just create an adjustment layer and now 
drag it on your footage and now we just apply some of the random LEDs on our adjustment layer and let's see how it look like I'm just drag it on our adjustment layer and as you can be see by applying the LEDs just drag and drop and our color will be automatically changed and now we are adding some of the different kind of LEDs here and as you can see so they are providing you many of the LEDs that's really enough I know some of them not good enough but by doing some of the changing the LEDs just blown and that's really perfect for your footage to make it more realistic where they provide many important elements how they forget for transitions so here sign up answer really comes in game I personally loved this transition just doing amazing job in transitions because they provide many I say hundred to thousand in just one of the project one of the best part of it they provide this transition with sound effects that's really impressive in the whole pack what I actually love so inside of transition punch 5.0 transition you got a project file of Premiere Pro just click on it and it will automatically open your Premiere Pro and in a few seconds it's done its job very well and now as you see they are providing you many of the transitions here for the different folders of transition which are really insane and each folder are contain different transition inside of it that's really good for every creator now let's try out some of the transition on our our footage and let's see how it is look like I'm just want to be putting some of the panoramic and now I just uh, putting some of the randoms like down RGB green and the most important thing to use this transition just off this track V1 which is your main track uh, otherwise they are just putting a preview video also on your track that's obviously and not everybody want so I'm just dragging it on our timeline and now let's see how it is look like it is in RGB version yeah that's really amazing the most important impressing point of this transition they are including with sound effects that's really good and that's really cool now let's check it out some of the other transitions as well uh, I want some like perspective spins I just want to be put zoom in let's put it in the middle point where our two foot is miss and now let's see yeah that's really cool they provide you sound effects as well so you don't need to find sound effects for your transition they provide you everything in single pack let's check it out some other transition and let's see how it is look like I'm just want to be put now swipe bounce and I'm just want to be put up wasn't I'm just deleting the previous one and now I'm just putting it and now let's look like yeah that's that's really cool they are providing uh, sound effects related to your transition so it's really feel very good each transition give is unique look that is the main point and the impressing point of these transitions so what do you actually do if you want to save this transition in your premiere pro don't worry about it they also providing you this opportunity they are providing you transition preset that is in 31 MB in size so that's really insane you just import it in your premiere pro and you done actually for that go to your premiere pro and just go to the effects panel now preset right click import preset now select your transition location and now just select your transition press ok and after a few seconds it will automatically add it in your preset option and now as you see the transition folder is added in our uh, preset folder and now here you can see there is also same with the project file what we are actually use and now I'm just using a random one on it and let's see how it is work like so the out is for our first footage and in for the second footage so now we can just apply it and let's see how it is look like I'm just applying the out on the first footage and the in for the second footage and let's see how this look like yeah that's really amazing but that's not a more realistic I really suggested you to use the project file as compared to the preset because it uh, didn't include the sound effects which is more realistic if you use sound effects so I really recommend you use the project file instead of preset and now let's check it out some of the other like shakers and now I'm just putting in for the second footage and out for the first footage and let's see how this look like 
yeah that's really cool so after reviewing this pack and after i personally use it i really recommended you this pack if you are searching for a good pack which provide you many like ton of elements so here is one of the best option is cena punch in just 49 bucks i hope you enjoyed this review video and if you want to know more about this cena punch link in description below must check it out and if you want to purchase this pack link will be mentioned in the description so yeah that's all for today i hope you like this video if you like give me a big thumbs up and comment below if you like this pack and if you want to know more about this pack let me know in the comment section and if you have any question let me know in the comment section everything will be appreciated thank you so much for watching this video till end i will see you in the next one